Hello, my name is Derek Franklin, and I'm an Applications Engineer here at GoEngineer. In this quick tip video, I'm going to show you how we can utilize the Batch Manager command in SOLIDWORKS Plastics to set up multiple analysis jobs to run immediately or at a later time. This can be very helpful if we have you know, multiple studies that we're going to run that maybe are going to take a long time and we want them to run overnight. I'm going to start by selecting the Batch Manager command, which is located on the SOLIDWORKS Plastics command tab. So this opens up our uh, batch manager dialog here. We can come over and browse to the location of the projects that we want to include in our batch analysis. So I'm just going to browse to that location here. I'm just going to select uh, the first project. So the model manager 02. I'm going to select the analysis type, shell and flow. And then I can click on the add analysis button. And that will add it to the list. And you'll see some additional options um, down here at the bottom as well. The change analysis option is used to change the type of analysis such as shell flow or shell pack. The delete analysis option is used to the to the delete an analysis from the list the arrows can be used to move an analysis up or down in the list depending on the order in which we want to solve them and then the start button is just to start the analysis process now we can also stop the analysis once it's started by clicking on the stop button we could specify a time in the future to start these analyses just by specifying that time here in the start time field I'm going to go ahead and add one more project here, the Model Manager 03. Again, select the shell flow type and add it. Now, the batch analysis jobs in the queue can be modified to add or change some of the settings, such as polymer or fill settings. Injection locations cannot be changed using this option. So if I select on the Model Manager 02, I'm going to change the polymer type here. So I'm just going to select the polymer option go into my material data bank here and I'm just going to select a new material. Just click in the check box and say OK. And for the Model Manager 03 I'm going to change the fill settings. So I'm going to click on the fill settings button and change the fill filling time to 0.5 seconds and say OK. And again, there's some additional settings that we can change, such as pack settings, cool settings, or warp settings here. And at this point, I'm ready to run my batch analysis. So I can go down and click on the Start button. And you'll see a little flyout down at the bottom right of the taskbar. Uh, just giving you some information about your analysis. To bring that back up, you can right click on it and click on Open Analysis. And that will bring back up the Analysis Manager. And I can see the status of my studies. Under the Execution State column, you will know that a study is completed when it shows executed in that field. So there you have it. A quick way to be able to run multiple studies. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.